In a world filled with chaos and uncertainty, the teachings of Marcus Aurelius offer a guiding light. Discover how the Stoic philosophy can empower you to navigate life's challenges, transform obstacles into opportunities, and embrace each moment with gratitude and purpose. Welcome to Timeless Wisdom, Embracing Stoicism with Marcus Aurelius. In this audiobook, we delve into the profound insights of one of history's greatest Stoic philosophers. Marcus Aurelius ruled as the Roman Emperor from 161 to 180 AD, yet his reflections on life, resilience and purpose remain remarkably relevant today. Through his teachings, we learn not just to endure hardships but to thrive amid them, recognizing that each obstacle is an invitation to grow. Join us as we explore Stoic life lessons, the importance of accepting mortality, and how we can cultivate a mindset that treasures every experience life has to offer. Focus Points The Wisdom of Marcus Aurelius Understanding the Timeless Teachings of a Philosopher Emperor Facing Today's Challenges Strategies for Combating Exhaustion and Negativity in a Demanding World The Treasure of Every Experience Learning to Appreciate All that Life Brings Both Good and Bad Finding Purpose How Centering Our Lives Around a Greater Purpose Can Lead to Fulfillment and Resilience Transforming Obstacles into Opportunities Practical ways to shift your perspective and leverage challenges for personal growth. Embracing mortality. How contemplating death can inspire us to live more fully and authentically. Conclusion. Reflecting on the lasting impact of Stoicism and how it can enhance our daily lives. Learning outcomes. Understand Stoic principles. Gain a foundational understanding of Stoic philosophy and its application to modern life. Resilience building. Learn techniques to build resilience and maintain mental clarity in the face of challenges. Perspective shift. Discover how to view obstacles as opportunities for growth and self-improvement. Enhanced gratitude. Develop an appreciation for life's experiences, fostering a deeper sense of gratitude and contentment. Mindful living. Cultivate a mindset that embraces mortality and encourages living each day to the fullest. Focus point one. The Enduring Wisdom of Marcus Aurelius Marcus Aurelius A Legacy of Timeless Wisdom Meditation stands as a unique and profound collection of personal reflections penned by Marcus Aurelius, the Stoic Emperor of Rome. This compilation of notes was not merely a diary. It served as a critical tool for Aurelius, helping him shape his own philosophy of life and aspire to the virtuous character he sought. These writings also provided a means for him to contemplate his extensive responsibilities and duties as a prominent military leader and emperor. The insights contained within meditations have proven to be both invaluable and timeless, resonating with individuals across diverse backgrounds and eras for nearly two millennia. So, who exactly was Marcus Aurelius? Born Marcus Annius Verus on April 26, AD 121, he ascended to the throne as the emperor of the Roman Empire ruling from A.D. 161 to 180. His reign occurred during a period when emperors were often viewed as divinely ordained figures, wielding immense power and wealth through the imperial cult. As a military commander, Marcus was both adept and victorious, undertaking numerous campaigns aimed at protecting and expanding his empire. His military prowess was matched by his dedication to effective governance. He approached his administrative duties with prudence and responsibility. Yet despite his many accomplishments, Marcus faced significant personal and domestic challenges. The early death of his beloved wife Faustina, along with the loss of several of his children, weighed heavily on him. By the end of his life only one son, Commodus, survived him. Unfortunately, Commodus's reign would tarnish Marcus's legacy, leading to a stark contrast between father and son. The Stoic philosophy teaches that individuals are responsible for their own reactions and emotions. It emphasizes the importance of taking charge of one's life and guiding oneself towards personal goals and fulfillment. Despite the many hardships he endured, Marcus Aurelius maintained an unwavering sense of humility and objectivity. In the face of these tribulations he composed twelve books in his journal, which collectively form meditations. This work has emerged as one of history's most practical and impactful philosophical texts. Join us as we delve into the profound teachings of Marcus Aurelius and explore how the lessons he imparted centuries ago remain incredibly relevant in navigating the complexities of the 21st century. Focus Point 2. 
battling the exhaustion of today's challenging world, navigating the turmoil of human interaction. In his writings, Marcus Aurelius highlights the inevitability of encountering challenges in our daily lives, often stemming from the ignorance and misbehavior of others. As we traverse through our interactions, we inevitably meet individuals who embody various negative traits. The ungrateful, the arrogant, the gossipers, the dishonest, the envious, and the irritable. Amidst this diversity of personalities, it's crucial that we remain steadfast in our principles and refuse to compromise our values. Aurelius prompts us to focus our care and attention on what truly matters, that our inclination be always set to embrace whatsoever shall happen unto us as necessary as usual as ordinary as flowing from such a beginning and such a fountain, from which both thyself and all things are. This powerful reminder emphasizes the importance of acceptance in the face of life's adversities. While we cannot control the actions or attitudes of others, we do have complete authority over our responses and behaviors. Our greatest influence lies within our own souls and minds. It is here that we can cultivate inner resilience, kindness and integrity, rather than waste our energy battling external circumstances that we cannot change. Importantly, Marcus teaches us that no one can impose negative emotions, such as anger, fear, sadness or oppression, upon us without our consent. People may attempt to tear us down out of jealousy or malice, but we must guard our minds and choose interpretations that uplift us. Ultimately, only we hold the power to determine how others affect our emotional states. Aurelius poignantly asserts that pain or grief cannot penetrate our hearts if we focus on managing our own thoughts and reactions rather than concerning ourselves with the turmoil in others' souls. He urges us to recognize that those who act maliciously do so out of ignorance of moral truths, and he encourages us to forgive their wrongdoings, even when we feel wounded by them. Furthermore, Marcus Aurelius believes that harboring disdain for others is contrary to our human nature. Imperfection is inherent in all of us, and it's essential to approach judgment with mindfulness. Instead of blaming others for their shortcomings, we should acknowledge that the world is filled with elements that conflict with our beliefs. While it's important to advocate for our values, trying to change every dissonant aspect of the world can lead to burnout and frustration. In his reflections, Aurelius emphasizes that our ability to control our thoughts acts as a protective shield for our minds, guarding against false perceptions and misconceptions. This inner control is what allows us to approach others with thoughtfulness and compassion, even in the face of adversity. Focus point 3. Treasure everything that comes your way. Embracing life's challenges with gratitude. In our daily lives, it's all too easy to fall into the trap of complaining about various inconveniences, be it traffic jams, slow internet connections, poor customer service, unfavorable weather, or even the struggles of life itself. Whenever we encounter obstacles, our instinct often leads us to vent our frustrations. However, one uncomfortable truth that many of us grapple with is that complaining does nothing to change our circumstances. While it may feel momentarily relieving to express our anger and dissatisfaction, all we achieve is a drain on our time and energy, potentially exacerbating the situation. This allure of complaining lies in its ability to let us articulate negativity without offering any solutions or taking responsibility for our challenges. Moreover, worrying about our difficulties yields no tangible benefits. When faced with a problem we should ask ourselves, can I do anything about this? If the answer is yes then why waste time complaining? Instead we should take action and do everything within our power to effect change. If the answer is no then fretting over the issue serves no purpose. As Marcus Aurelius wisely reminds us, we can either confront the challenges life presents or avoid them. If possible, our focus should be on proactive solutions rather than exacerbating our woes through complaining. One aspect of his role as emperor that Marcus Aurelius found particularly unappealing was holding court. Yet, despite his dislike for this responsibility, he never shied away from it. He understood that, as emperor, he had a duty to fulfill. Trusting in the grand scheme of existence, he accepted that dealing with scheming courtiers and their trivial arguments was part of the universe's plan for him. As a dedicated Stoic, Marcus Aurelius firmly embraced the concept of amor fati, which translates to love of fate. The Stoics teach that true happiness and peace of mind stem from accepting all that life throws our way, including pain and loss, as inherently positive experiences. This philosophy encourages us to view every encounter, whether joyful or challenging, 
as an opportunity for growth and valuable life lessons. Ultimately, life is too precious to squander our time on complaints and grievances. Instead of brooding and placing blame, we should focus on taking action. By doing so, we can cultivate a mindset that treasures every experience, understanding that even the difficult moments contribute to our personal growth and resilience. Interestingly, Marcus Aurelius never intended for meditations to be published. His writings were meant solely for his own clarity and self-improvement, serving as a private philosophical guide to navigate the complexities of life. This insight into his motivations underscores the importance of introspection and personal development in our pursuit of a meaningful existence. Focus point four. Purpose should be the center of our presence. Embracing our unique roles in life. Marcus Aurelius teaches that every individual possesses a unique purpose, something integral to our existence. According to Stoic philosophy, we are all interconnected parts of a larger whole, each with our own responsibilities that contribute to the greater good. Everything on earth, humans, animals, and even inanimate objects, has a specific role and purpose. In this context, Marcus Aurelius emphasizes that our primary duty on earth is to seek virtue. He posits that living a virtuous life is the highest calling we can aspire to. To embody virtue means committing to principles such as honesty, discipline, and courage. Marcus Aurelius encourages us to rise each morning with the intention of doing good work. He advocates for approaching each day with gratitude, focusing on how we can positively contribute to society without being swayed by the judgments of others. The essence of this mindset is to act selflessly. We should perform our good deeds without expectation of reward, finding satisfaction in the knowledge that we are part of something much greater than ourselves. After all, virtue in its purest form is its own reward. Additionally, Marcus reminds us that each of us possesses unique strengths. There are activities that we excel at and enjoy more than others. Discovering and nurturing these natural talents enables us to serve others better. When we leverage our skills to add value to the lives of those around us, we not only enhance our productivity but also cultivate a deeper sense of fulfillment and happiness. Aurelius also emphasizes the importance of living in the present moment. It's easy to fall into the trap of ruminating over past mistakes or anxiously envisioning future failures. However, he reminds us that the past is irretrievable and the future remains uncertain. Both are beyond our control. What truly matters is the present moment which is within our sphere of influence. Therefore, we should dedicate our time and energy to meaningful actions that enrich our lives and those of others. By anchoring our existence in purpose, we can navigate life's complexities with clarity and intent. Marcus Aurelius invites us to embrace our roles, focus on virtue, and live each moment to its fullest potential, reminding us that fulfillment lies in the journey of serving others and aligning our actions with our higher purpose. Focus point five. Treat obstacles as opportunities. Embracing challenges as growth experiences. Life inevitably presents us with obstacles, ranging from minor inconveniences like traffic jams to significant hardships such as job disappointments, technical failures, flight cancellations, or the loss of loved ones. These challenges come in various forms, and while they can feel overwhelming, they are a universal part of the human experience. When confronted with obstacles, we typically have two distinct responses. We can choose to succumb to bitterness, hostility, and discouragement, lamenting our fate and wondering, why me? This perspective only amplifies our frustrations and leaves us feeling victimized by circumstances. Alternatively, we can adopt a mindset that views obstacles as opportunities for growth. This involves reframing our challenges as valuable lessons in endurance, patience, resilience, and perseverance. A crucial shift in mindset is to ponder the reasons behind the hardship we are experiencing. Rather than asking why this is happening to us, we can ask, what can I learn from this situation? This perspective aligns with Stoic philosophy as articulated by Marcus Aurelius, who understood that obstacles are often opportunities in disguise. For him, challenges were avenues for personal growth and success. A poignant example from Aurelius' life occurred in 175 AD when he faced a decline in health amid troubling news. Avidius Cassius, his closest friend and trusted general, had revolted and proclaimed himself emperor. Instead of reacting with anger or disappointment, Marcus Aurelius chose to respond with a message of peace and forgiveness. When Cassius was captured, rather than executing him for treason, Aurelius pardoned him, 
demonstrating his commitment to higher principles over personal betrayal. Recognizing that unpredictability and hardships are part of life leads us to a more productive mindset. Instead of resisting or fleeing from challenges, we should cultivate acceptance, courage, and inner peace. As Marcus Aurelius reflects, true perfection in life is attained when we approach each day as if it were our last, fully embracing the present and confronting our obstacles head-on. When faced with any challenge regardless of its magnitude, do not shy away or become discouraged. Embrace the problem with determination and resolve. Remember that within every situation lies the potential for transformation. Like nature which adapts and uses every difficulty to its advantage, we too can harness the lessons inherent in our obstacles to grow stronger and wiser. Focus Point 6. Mortality can inspire you to live your best life. Embracing life's impermanence. Contemplating our mortality is often uncomfortable, as it confronts us with the reality that life is transient and fleeting. While we may yearn for immortality, the truth remains. Every human life will eventually come to an end. Despite humanity's attempts to evade death, it is an undeniable part of our existence. In light of our inevitable mortality, we face a choice. We can either ignore this truth, clinging to the comforting illusion of unlimited time, or we can confront it head on, transforming our awareness of death into a catalyst for positive change and purposeful living. Marcus Aurelius frequently reflects on the impermanence of life in his meditations. He reminds himself of the great individuals who came before him, their achievements and ultimately their deaths. This perspective underscores the stoic belief that understanding and accepting the inevitability of death is essential for living a good life. By acknowledging mortality, we can cultivate a mindset that frees us from the fear of the unknown. The Value of Memento Mori the more we contemplate the temporary nature of life, the less we cling to it and consequently the less we fear death. Recognizing that endings provide meaning to new beginnings encourages us to be mindful of how we spend our time. Are we engaging in activities aligned with our passions, or are we wasting precious moments on trivial pursuits? The only time we truly possess is now, and there are no guarantees for what tomorrow may bring. Thus, we must ensure that our present moments reflect our values and desires. The Stoic phrase, memento mori, meaning remember that you will die, serves as a powerful reminder of our mortality. Living with this awareness fosters a sense of perspective, enabling us to distinguish between what is significant and what is not. Understanding that our days are numbered imbues us with urgency and purpose, prompting us to approach each day with gratitude and to make the most of every moment. Cultivating a meaningful life. By embracing the reality of our mortality, we can unlock a deeper appreciation for life. We become more intentional in our actions, prioritizing what truly matters. The awareness of our limited time inspires us to pursue our passions, nurture our relationships and engage fully in the present. Each day becomes an opportunity to create meaningful experiences, fostering a sense of fulfillment and purpose. In summary, mortality when acknowledged and embraced can inspire us to live our best lives. Rather than being a source of fear, it can serve as a guiding force, urging us to live with intention, gratitude, and a commitment to what truly matters. Conclusion The meditations of Marcus Aurelius resonate with timeless relevance, even nearly 2,000 years after they were written. Through his reflections Aurelius grapples with profound questions that remain pertinent today. Why are we here? How should we live our lives? How do we cope with pain and misfortune? How can we navigate the stresses of daily life? And how do we reconcile our existence with the inevitability of our mortality? The core lesson that emerges from his writings is the importance of focusing on what we can influence while relinquishing concern for what lies beyond our control. Worrying drains our energy, an invaluable resource that should be dedicated to nurturing our minds instead. Rather than engaging in futile battles against external circumstances, we should strive to cultivate inner peace acceptance and resilience, building meaningful connections with others, pursuing virtues, and allowing our purpose to guide our actions are essential practices for a fulfilling life. Aurelius' insights encapsulate the essence of Stoic philosophy. They remind us to embody virtue, remain present, take charge of our thoughts, concentrate on what we can control and dismiss distractions. Our minds and the present moments are our most significant assets and sources of power. Thus, we must maximize their potential. To apply this wisdom in your own life, 
Take a moment to reflect on situations that drain your emotional energy yet lie beyond your control. Write these down then identify the aspects you can control, your thoughts and responses. Keep this reflection as a reminder when you find yourself emotionally attached to uncontrollable outcomes. This practice will empower you to channel your energy where it serves you best, fostering a more peaceful and purposeful existence. The teachings of Marcus Aurelius offer invaluable guidance for navigating life's complexities. By embracing his wisdom, we can cultivate resilience, find purpose, and live more authentically in the present moment. Thank you for joining us on this enlightening journey through the meditations of Marcus Aurelius. In this audiobook, we've explored profound insights that remain relevant today. Here are the key focus points we covered. Treasure everything. Embrace life's challenges as opportunities for growth rather than reasons to complain. Purpose-centered living. Recognize that every individual has a unique purpose. Living virtuously is essential for fulfillment. Obstacles as opportunities. View difficulties as chances to learn and develop resilience, patience and strength. Mortality as motivation. Contemplate your mortality to inspire a life lived with urgency and gratitude. Focus on what you can control. Direct your energy towards your thoughts and actions rather than worrying about external circumstances. Practical recommendations. Keep a journal to reflect on situations that drain your emotional energy and identify what you can control. Practice gratitude daily by acknowledging the positives in your life, regardless of external challenges. Cultivate a mindset of acceptance and resilience by treating obstacles as opportunities for personal growth. Reflecting on the overall learning experience, we see how these stoic principles can empower us to navigate life's complexities with grace and purpose. Each lesson reminds us of the importance of focusing on what truly matters, nurturing our inner peace and living authentically. We sincerely appreciate your time and interest in this audiobook. Your engagement means a lot to us and we encourage you to like, subscribe and share this content. By doing so you help spread these valuable lessons to others. Remember, listening to audiobooks not only enriches your knowledge but also enhances your language skills. As you engage with this material the more you listen the better you speak. Keep exploring, growing and applying these insights in your life. Thank you once again and we look forward to seeing you in our next episode.